What is the one thing that keeps you up at night? The thing that doesn't let you rest. It just doesn't give you a chance to think about anything else. You're thinking about how much time has passed in your life and not even knowing where that time went. But that so much of your life was spent not doing that one thing. There was a time in your life where you would have given anything to do it, anything to have that. You might even say that there was a time you tried to chase it, but it didn't work out. And so you just went on and did all the things people do when they can't achieve their dreams. So you got married to somebody that you ended up despising just to spend the last decade washing their clothes, making them food, and not chasing your dreams. Putting on hold, becoming that painter you knew you always wanted to be, or going on tour with your poetry because you knew you had something you wanted to tell the world. All things you couldn't do because you had to take care of someone other than yourself. And maybe you're listening to this thinking, it's too late, I should have done this in my 20s in my 30s and my 30s are quickly expiring if they're not already expired and why would you even talk about that now i'm letting you know i'm just like you i've had the same dream my whole life and i've tried to chase it my whole life and i have not yet gotten there and it is my goal to spend the rest of this decade showing all generations that there is no such thing timeline for dreams. There is no such thing as an expiration on your goals. To show that Gen X or the boomers or the ex-millennials, that even though we might have taken a detour, it's not the end of our story. If you're listening to this, give me a follow because I'm going to share my story with you and I want to hear yours. You guys, if I can wake up and decide one day that my dreams are still going to be reality, so can you.